Hello and welcome back. And in this video, I will tell you about one of the best video editors in the market. It is called Flixir. You can create and publish with the fastest video creator, uh, video editor, and it has over 1 million people using it. So stay tuned and I will show you how you can um, use Flixer right in your browser, how you can edit fast, how you can edit easy. And of course, uh, this is something that's gonna change your uh, work habits and maybe your social habits as well. So uh, you can edit videos for different uh, types of platforms. So you can edit uh, it for YouTube, you can make your online course, you can make your webinar, Twitch streams, Zoom recordings and marketing videos. So it is powerful online video editor. What is cool about it? That uh, you can collaborate in real time. So synchronize projects in real time with all your colleagues and share files instantly. Even better, you can ask for feedback on your video with a click of a button and no rendering required. It works exactly how it works in Google Docs. So you can add um, some motion graphics. They have some stock footage and stock audio that you can use and you can master your video with just a few clicks. Uh, other features that they offer, real-time collaboration, building stock libraries, more than 50 transitions, video effects, webcam record, browser-based, print screen, powerful timeline, and screen record. So let's switch um, to the tool and see how it works, and I want to show you some of the features. So we are here on the on the page where you can create your own project. All you need to do is uh, click here. You create the name, let it be Slay, and then you choose uh, what format is suitable for your video. And again, everything is very convenient because they explain uh, what format is good for what platform. So I will choose a portrait, a portrait one. It's good for stories, IGTV and mobile videos. And I click create. After that, you import the videos that you want to include all the content videos or, or photos or audio. I, um, I've already imported some, uh, some pieces that I want to include in my video. So they are so I just drag them down on the timeline and move whatever way I, I want them to, to be. And I put it right here and right here. So um, when they are on my timeline, I can actually see them and I can move them to different tracks. And after that, I can um, deal with uh, each piece and I can, for example, trim it, which is super easy to do. I just do it uh, from the sides of the video uh, to whatever length I want it to be. Uh, when, I, when I'm done with uh, trimming, I can also cut some pieces. Uh, for example, I can cut like this and move it here. Yeah. And I can, for example, delete this part. And that's perfect. So <clears throat> uh, when I'm done with trimming and cutting, uh, I can um, I can think about transition. So all I need to do is overlay the video a little bit and I can see how exactly how long it's gonna take. Yeah, so and uh, you can see how it works. And it's nice. There is also this um, this um, left bar with <clears throat> with a transition uh, section, and you can choose whatever transition you want. So I have this <clears throat> uh, bar on the right where I can adjust uh, fade in and fade out, uh, as you can see. But if I don't want to have fade out uh, right away because this is not the end of the video, I just delete it, and that's good. And I can delete uh, the tra the <clears throat> transition in. Uh, so, uh, when it's all uh, done, I can also uh, think about other things that I can add to my video. So, for example, I can add motion uh, to the video, for example, like a call to action. And I just uh, drag it, <clears throat> for example, right here. 
and I trim it a little bit so it's so it's so it fits my video and then I uh, play it and I see how it works yes subscribe and like the video perfect I can also uh, put some texts or titles so there there can be a title that's gonna be right in the beginning for example and I type in um, wait so I can type in any um, uh, any text that I want so start out yeah and that's perfect so and I for example I play the video there is a title there is call to action and that's perfect and of course you can add uh, you can add uh, some text that uh, that you need you can also have subtitles you can do it manually or upload your subtitles or do it um, uh, with auto feature and uh, there is a uh, an audio part where you can choose a track that you want if you don't your your own track or your own music you can add the one from the library which is totally free and you you can put it like on that track for example uh, yeah and you adjust the volume so it's not super loud and um, that's it I would actually make it smaller yeah I would just make it like like that and I would trim it like from that side as well right I would put it I would put this one right here so it's going to be something like this and the music the the audio track is still uh, rendering it needs some time but in general it looks like this so um and when you are done with everything that you intended to have in your video you can export it so you uh, save the file as a video you export and download and that's it it's downloading it pretty easy right so you can try it out by yourself just follow the link which i leave uh, below this video right for you uh, enjoyed um, improve your uh, your performance and of course i wish you good luck and very good results and a lot of use bye bye